Brian, how much of a factor was no Kevin tonight? Obviously, missed Jr. too, but uh, two big holes that you had to fill. Uh, we had our chances, um, but you know, from the first quarter on, you know, even I think we had, it was twenty four seventeen at one point. Kyrie got it going, kind of got a little bit um, going, but after that, kind of like you know, our legs kind of got up underneath us from you know last night's travel and yesterday's game. But um, so you got to do a better job, which we will. You obviously made some strides the last two games coming into tonight. What can you do to get that back after uh, you know the loss? I'll just move on to the next one. Figure out a way to get better. We're gonna watch film tomorrow. Well, we'll be probably off tomorrow, but we'll watch film before Wednesday's game and and uh, go from there. You had about seven and eight for the month of January. Uh, just are you happy this is over with, or like that seems a lot. You wouldn't think going into the season you guys would have a month where you, you lose more games. Um. I've had better months. I've had worse months in my career. Never get too high. Never get too low about it. Stay even kill. And uh, just you know, you know, get better and make the next the next game or the next month you know better than the last one. When Kevin's not out there, where do you guys miss him the most? It's, I mean, it's everybody. It's not just Kev. I mean, you know, we miss Kev tonight. We miss Jr. You know, Bird is out. So, you know, we got a lot of guys that's out. You know, that means a big part of our of our team. So. You know, um, you know, it's not just you know with Kevin. And obviously, Kevin, you know, is a big piece because he's an All Star. Obviously, we know what he brings to the table with a double double threat every night. Um, well, you know, the experience. You know, we have the experience in Kev, the experience in Jr., the experience in Bird. You know, we miss that. Anything else? It's not every night that you see two of the greats uh, kind of going going at it. What does what does Dirk mean to you, and just being able to play against him? Um, no, I mean it's just been an honor, you know, to play against him. You know, for so long, you know, and uh, both of our careers, and um, you know, I don't know uh, when he's going to decide to to hang him up. I don't know when I'm going to decide to hang him up, but I never take for granted going against some of the greats. And uh, Dirk is definitely that. We didn't see much of Kyle Corbett tonight. When do y'all plan on getting him in the rotation? Uh, he was on the court. It was uh, he played 26 minutes, so. Might want to put some glasses on. <laughs> Do you expect any more moves before the trade deadline? Uh, if it happens, it happens. But, you know, we got what we got. We got to get better every day, and we'll do that. Turk's final line might not look like, you know, what we're accustomed to, but he had a big three. I think it was maybe eight or nine, and you know, he was open on the left wing. He made it. What does that say about, you know, the type of player he is? Uh, I don't I don't know. Um He's a great player. I mean, right. he's, gonna make, he's gonna make shots. Everybody's on the court for a reason. He's gonna make shots no matter, you know, what uh, caliber or you know what part of the year or what part of the career they're in. I mean, it's Dirk. Do you, you expect him to miss that? Nope. Well, what was the biggest difference in the, in the mass from what you saw much earlier this year in November when you beat him by 38? Um, I don't even remember that game to be honest. And when, when November? I don't even remember November. Um, you know, at the end of the day, you just play every game. It doesn't matter what you did before or, you know, what you did, you know, in the previous game. You just, you know, you play the game, you have a game plan, you try to execute it and, you know, and see who wins. And uh, they got the better of us tonight. You've run 12 for 32 from three-point line. How do you guys get better? Keep shooting. You've mentioned in the past um, your turnovers and the team turnovers usually go up when you're trying to integrate new players or different rotations and things like that. Mm -hmm. Do you chalk what happened tonight up to that sort of thing, using different guys that? Uh, well, we have some guys in, in, in different situations that they've been in. Uh, we got some foul trouble early in the first half with Tristan and, and, and Jr. And, you know, we had to go deeper into our bench, you know, so we had some lineups out on the floor that was kind of unusual. But at the end of the day, when the number is called, when guys' number is called, we got to figure it out. And, you know, for myself and Kyrie to have 11 of our team's turnovers together, you know, it's uncalled for. And, we, you know, we get better with it. Anything else, guys? Kevin Love squares up and hits it again. The open floor. Wilson scores. No look. Drops it inside. The punting continues. There's a touchdown.